क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स द थ्री कोपलेनर थ्री कोपलेनर फोर्सेस ऑफ मैग्नीट्यूड टेन न्यूटन ट्वेंटी फाइव न्यूटन ट्वेंटी न्यूटन एक्ट एट अ पॉइंट ओ इन द डायरेक्शन शोन इन द डायग्राम गिवन दैट द कंपोनेंट्स ऑफ द रिजल्टेंट फोर्स इन द एक्स डायरेक्शन इज जीरो इट इज गिवन दैट रिजल्टेंट कंपोनेंट ऑफ द रिजल्टेंट फोर्स इन द एक्स डायरेक्शन इज जीरो फाइंड एल्फा एंड हेंस फाइंड द मैग्नीट्यूड ऑफ द रिजल्टेंट फोर्स तो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल रिजॉल्व दीज थ्री फोर्सेज विल फाइंड horizontal and vertical components but horizontal component x x direction resultant force in the x direction is zero find alpha so we have resolved this in the diagram you can see 10 newton force is resolved this is the components this is a com this component is along x axis this component is along y axis and 25 newton this is a component along x axis this component is along y axis in the same way 20 newton force this component is along x axis this component is along y axis so now we will find the sum of components along x axis we represent it by x x is equal to sum of uh, sum of uh, components along x axis uh, look at the diagram components 25 cos 60 degree rightward hai plus 10 cos alpha minus 20 cos 30 degree is equal to zero this component is zero it is given in the question statement x direction is component along x in the x direction is zero so so this is zero uh, we can write it as <clears throat> 10 cos alpha or is uh, term ko aur is term ko hum simplify karke yahan likh lete hain minus 4.82 is equal to 0 from here we can find alpha cos alpha is equal to 0.4 uh, 8 to alpha is equal to cos inverse 0.482 that becomes uh, 61.2 degree this is alpha now we will use alpha to find the value of r now first of all we will find the uh, sum of vertical com uh, sum of uh, components along y axis so this is y sum of y components tan sin alpha tan sin alpha 20 sin 30 and this this is our in opposite direction we will take it in negative so so this becomes y is equal to 10 sin alpha plus 20 sin 30 degree minus 25 sin 60 degree after simplifying we get this y is equal to negative 2.8 8 nine now what is the magnitude of the resultant that is uh, r is the magnitude of magnitude of the resultant this is x square 
x components का स्केयर प्लस y components स्केयर होल अंडर रूट सो दिस शोज दैट r इज इक्वल टू x components स्केयर इज 0 इट इज गिवन y स्केयर मीन दिस स्केयर दिस स्केयर दिस बिकम माइनस माइनस टू पॉइंट एट एट नाइन स्केयर होल अंडर रूट अल्टीमेटली दिस बिकम्स आर इज इक्वल टू टू पॉइंट एट नाइन न्यूटन दिस इज द आंसर नो नेक्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन वी गिवन इंस्टेड दैट अल्फा इज इक्वल टू फोर्टी फाइव नो दिस अल्फा बिकम्स इन अ नेक्स्ट पार्ट अल्फा इज नो इन द नेक्स्ट पार्ट इज फोर्टी we only change the uh, angle the value of the angle no x becomes uh ab x jo hai wo zero nahi hoga kyunki angle jo hai wo 45 degree hai so 20 sum of uh, components along x axis uh, along x in uh, in the x direction is 25 cos 60 degree plus 10 cos 20, uh, 45 degree minus 20 cos 30 degree uh, after simplifying it becomes 2.251 similarly we find the sum of uh, components along y axis that is 10 10 sin alpha, no alpha is 45, plus 10 sin, 20 sin 30, and this component, we are adding these, 10 cos 45 degree, plus 20 sin 30 degree, minus 25 sin 60 degree, then after simplifying it becomes by minus 4.58 now this is x and this is y now we find r r will be magnitude of uh, the resultant force that is x square plus y square whole under root this is x square this is square or this is square lenge yahan pe this becomes 2.251 square plus minus 4.58 square whole under root after simplifying we get r is equal to 5.10 newton and also we have to find the direction of the resultant magnitude and the direction of the resultant no direction for direction this is the direction theta is equal to tan inverse uh, y over x so this is uh, theta is equal to tan inverse uh, minus 4.58 over uh, 2.251 now for, to find the angle we uh, ignore this negative sign to find the angle first we ignore this negative uh, sign to find the basic angle so from here we can find theta is equal to 63.8 degree this is the direction of the resultant but we will give here the uh, reference of the angle since the 
y is negative look at this y this is y or this is x y is negative x is positive this lies uh, in this quadrant so, so this is the angle so, so the reference of this angle is theta is equal to 63.8 degree below positive x axis this is below positive x axis below positive x axis this is the reference of this direction direction of the resultant 